welcome to another Mad Hatter review. You know, they say in life, all a man needs is his trusty spoon. Actually, I, I've never heard that saying, but I'm going to need this today because we are reviewing the <laughs> Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem cereal. Little known fact about me, I am sort of a cereal fanatic, okay? Only very, very few people know it. It's like the people that know that Prince Adam is He-Man, okay? I love all kinds of cereals, Reese's Peanut Butter Cup, uh, uh, the, the, the Special K, all the different ones. Whenever there's like a new cereal, I kind of have to try it because that's, it's just kind of my obsession. I'm, I'm, I'm very Seinfeld-esque that way. So when this came out, I was like, Cereal plus Ninja Turtles, no brainer, okay? Uh, so Ninja Turtles, Mutant Mayhem, and obviously this is from the new movie, Mutant Mayhem. This is made by General Mills Family Size, although I think there's only one size here. And uh, if you remember the old Ninja Turtle cereal from way back with the little nets and the marshmallow, this is a little throwback to that. Or maybe it's maybe there's only so many ways you can make cereal, but this has, it's a cinnamon Sorry, Cowabunga Cinnamon Apple. Not to be confused with regular cinnamon apple. This is the Cowabunga style. And then you got these little Ninja Turtle marshmallows, and they're all in the different colors of the Ninja Turtles. That's freaking cute. And you have this awesome uh, cover art right here. Uh, you got the side right here with uh, just some art. And then you have uh, this, all the nutritional facts right here. Calories, uh, 140 uh, a, a serving, okay? And then on the back, you have this little uh, maze, okay? You can play, you can flip a coin, and then uh, you move your marshmallow here to defeat Bebop and Rocksteady. But here's the trick, okay? Uh, I bought two of these for this reason, is this only goes so far. At the end, it says, finish, uh, find more uh, for game two, okay? Because they want you to buy more cereal. And so uh, take a look at this. Uh, different packages have different mazes, and if you combine them, you can get all the way to uh, Superfly, who I guess is like the main villain, I think. And uh, uh, yeah, so if you want to play the full game, you got to go deuces on this fucking cereal. <laughs> well, don't go deuces on the cereal. That's kind of gross. But you know what I mean. You eat pieces of shit for breakfast? What I wanted to do is... Is this a... No, I, 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 I tried Chef Boyardee before. I, I was going to say, is this a first Hatter food... Uh, a tryout, but no, I, I've done it before. But this is, I think, number two. And I think this is the first cereal that I'm going to try. So apropos Ninja Turtle cereal, without further ado, let's go ahead and pour us a bowl. Now, if we're going to have a bowl of Ninja Turtle cereal, we're not going to use just any bowl. We are going to use this bowl right here. This is, if you don't know, uh, when the original cereal came out, 80s, 90s, I think early 90s, uh, they came packed in with different Ninja Turtle bowls, okay? Raphael, Leonardo, you, you know them all, okay? And uh, when I say packed in, they were kind of like strapped to the front of the bowl. These weren't inside the cereal. At the time, I thought that was the coolest thing. And uh, it actually, it, it still is pretty cool. If they re-released Ninja Turtles and had bowls like this, uh, it would be awesome. But uh, yeah, so you could get all the different Ninja Turtles. And this is, was not, this is not my original bowl. I bought this uh, on the aftermarket. I don't know how much I paid, but uh, yeah, Raphael bowl right here. It's all clean. It's all washed. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and pour some cereal here. Which one am I going to open with which maze? I'm going to open the uh, Bebop and Rock. No, I'm going to open the other one. Be very careful because I do want to uh, keep these boxes, okay? Because, you know, Ninja Turtle cereal. Come on. And then there you go. There's the beautiful cereal just waiting, waiting to be devoured. First cereal smell. Smells very cinnamony. Pour some in our bowl right here. I didn't get a lot of marshmallows, okay? But there you go. This bowl doesn't, it's, it's small. I don't know. My hands are not gigantic. It's a small bowl. I mean, they're okay sized. Don't read too into that. And then we're going to go ahead and take this milk, fat-free milk. You could tell by the blue. And we're going to just pour it into the bowl right here. Just a splash of milk. <laughs> and then we grab the trusty spoon and uh, here we go. Let's go in. First time, Mutant Mayhem uh, cereal. Let me see. Could I, could I do this? Could I, could I put this right here? Just to make this uh, nice and eventful. And uh, let's go right here. I'm going to get some marshmallows. Who am I getting here? I got two Raphaels and I got a Donatello and a Leonardo, okay? Bottoms up. It's good. It's very cinnamony. Okay, so <laughs> beware. If you don't like cinnamon, uh, don't get this because it's like one of those flavors that that's all you taste. It, I, I, I'm not even getting a lot of marshmallow, uh, but I'm getting mostly cinnamon. So I like cinnamon. 
take that for what it's worth. I, I like cinnamon toast crunch or whatever. If you do not like cinnamon, cinnamon was a little bit of an odd choice. I would think they went, they go through like, uh, I don't know, like what Lucky Charms does, but maybe they wanted to stay away from Lucky Charms, but it's a decent cereal, okay? Decent. It's, <laughs> let's face it. You're getting this because it's Ninja Turtles. The flavor is just, it's just okay, all right? Um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie. It's not, it's no Cookie Crisps um, or uh, uh, Reese's Peanut Butter Cup uh, uh, cereal, or not Peanut Butter Cup, you, you know the one I'm talking about, uh, but it's an okay um, cereal for like a brand cereal. It's no Lucky Charms. Lucky Charms is my favorite. I thought this might be close to Lucky Charms, but uh, it's not quite there. But you're eating Ninja Turtles in a bowl, and uh, yeah, I think if you have kids, they'll probably like this. Uh, maybe introduce them to cinnamon, and then you can have fun with your kids and 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 uh, uh, go through this maze. Or if you're an adult, go through this maze too. But remember, you gotta get two boxes, and you gotta look at the back of the box and make sure that uh, uh, you have you can get like the extended maze. So, uh, in terms of cereal review, do I give this a rating? It's an average cereal. It's a very average cereal, but it's Ninja Turtle cereal, so I gotta get it because you know I'm me. That's all I got. Cereal review. I think first Hatter. Mad Hatter cereal review. Was it a success? Who knows? Only time will determine that. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and finish the rest of the cereal right here. Uh, not on camera. I'll do that off camera. Oh, by the way, I got these from Walmart, okay? And uh, there weren't that many. There was, I think, just like, it, it looks like pretty much somebody cleaned out uh, uh, most of the shelves. But uh, I think Walmart, I, th I feel like Walmart is the only one that I have heard uh, that has been getting them in. Uh, maybe they are in other places, but as the movie does get closer to release, you'll probably see these uh, a, a lot more. So if you're into cereal that has cinnamon, uh, a cinnamony taste, and you're into Ninja Turtles, go ahead and uh, get this. I think it was like $3.99. Cereal review in the bag. Cereal also in the bag, and that bag is in a box. Comment, subscribe, drop me a like. We'll see you next time. Cowabunga. <laughs>